This is a uh, really quick excerpt from an interview I had with my friend who is a former EF teacher. I wanted to know how uh, teachers or how people considering applying to teach at EF could stand out. And so he gives a great explanation on what EF is looking for in their applicants and how you can kind of tailor your application to meet what they want their teachers to be. So this is a yeah, really quick, insightful piece. I hope you enjoy it. Um, I had a quick question for you. I know you worked uh, at EF and being such a large company, I want to know if you had any interview tips for people that were considering doing the same. Uh, yes, I think what's most important is you need to understand the company first off. <laughs> and what's big for EF is that they, you know, they are different. And what I mean by that is they go out of their way to create uh, classrooms that are far from non-traditional. Mm -hmm. And so there's not a load of textbook work, you know, like a lot of normal schools, regular schools. Uh, you're going to get a lot of you know, as the teacher, you're going to have to come up with the activities and games that forces the students to get out of their seats and interact. Mm -hmm. So interact with the language. So what EF is looking for is they want these not just to be learning experiences, but they really want them to be fun and just active. Okay. And it's something I didn't expect. So I think as someone in an interview with EF, like you're going to want to show that you are creative enough to come up with all these little games and activities, uh, try to prove how some of these games could force the kids, including the shy ones, they're yeah. really big on that, to interact with the language. And then you basically just have to show a personality. Like, That's, you know, a lot yeah. of uh, stereotypes for teachers are very, you know, yeah, serious. And if you interview with EF like that, you may not be right for them. Whereas if you, you know, you loosen up, you have a personality, sense of humor, then they're going to want you because yeah. the kids will love you. That's all. Yeah. Okay. I completely agree. And your, uh, was your interview like virtual? Was it on the computer or did you go somewhere and talk to an actual person face to face? Uh, it was virtual. So okay. Skype at like midnight my yeah. time. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Matt. All right. Well, uh, I appreciate that. I'm sure everyone out there is considering applying for them will appreciate it as well because interviewing I think is intimidating in the best of circumstances. And when you're kind of doing it virtually with a company, you know, all the way in China, it's even more so. So thank you. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any videos or interviews in the future.